On the other question of the bullion van or no bullion van and all of that, I think that matter has been put to rest. There was no money in the bullion van. The bullion van that even came uh, missed uh, the, uh, the address to have come there. Okay. It missed the address to have come there, and that was why the bullion van was... But why was bullion van moving on election day? I thought there was supposed to be no movement. No, there was not an election day. It no, was but, not. It was a uh, Rufai. Day before, it was, day I, was, I, was, I was in that house on that very day. Yeah. The day it election. was not an so election. So it was the day before election. But it why was, was bullion van moving The everywhere? bullion van was missed the address to have come there. Okay. I thought your presidential candidate had actually said that um, what's people's he business said, with how he spends I, I money. I watched it. He yeah. said that jokingly. Okay. It was a joking statement. So the bullion van missed the same way, what, what, the, same way, the same way Mr. Dangote said that when he wanted to authenticate and get his mindset that truly he has money, he went to cash one million naira, brought it to his house, sat and looked at his money and returned it to the bank. No, but well, I just want to get this right. You said the bullion van missed his way to come into the place. Yes. But that place is not a known bank, or was it a bank? I just want there, to get there, to the root there, of them. There, there, are some companies, there are some companies that have high staff that pay their staff with cash, okay. right? That bullion van missed his way there. Okay. And it was not invited by Ashwadu or anybody. Okay, uh, okay. comrade. Uh, uh, bullion vans have become un un unidentified moving objects or flying objects in Nigeria. That's fine. We hope this time around nobody will carry bullion vans around. 